Hey guys, what is up? It's Dallas back here again, and today I am reviewing my first gas blowback airsoft pistol. Um, I got the Glock 19X by Umarex, or Umarex, I don't know how you say it, I've always said like Umarex, but uh, um, yeah, I bought this off eBay for about $200, which I think is a little bit ridiculous for a um, toy gun, well not really a toy, but you know, um, but I got this off eBay, and it surprisingly it actually came with a bag of bb's and a full can of green gas which is awesome because green gas is so expensive and it's so hard to find so it's so awesome that this came with at least one can i'll have to buy more cans later but let's go on and get this thing open here i am so excited to um unbox my first um green gas pistol all right so what's inside Look at this. Nice. So it's got an Allen wrench and what's that? That's a, this has instructions there or manual, whatever that is. Let's just look at the gun. Oh, wow. I've seen most people's reviews of this. Um, there's the. Oh, I can un look at that. I can just unscrew it. I think. It feels like it's unscrewing, right? I can't. It's moving, but. Okay, I don't think this is unscrewing. Okay, so this is not unscrewing. It's just um, loose on here. I'm sure there's some way to take that off. I'll figure that out in a minute. But look at this. Oh, magazine is metal. The body is of a nice polymer. Oh, that feels so good. Look at that. That is so freaking cool. This feels like a real Glock. Okay, I can see why this is so expensive. Now, this literally feels like a real Glock. That is so freaking cool. Okay, so I was unfortunately not able to get the orange tip off because like, I have no idea how to take this off. But um, let's go on and fill this magazine up with green gas. Uh, I'm not 100% sure how to do it, but I've seen reviews of it. So it's kind of... I kind of swore I saw reviews where it showed this thing sliding off. All right, so I got that slid off now. Now let's uh, put the green, green gas in. Okay, uh, guys, I have no idea what I'm doing here. This is my first time using a green gas gun. I think they said you're supposed to hold this on there for about four to six seconds. Sorry, right, and one, two, three, four. Okay, that should be good. <clears throat> All right, let's uh, fill this magazine up and go outside and shoot it. All right, guys, we're outside. Got a fully loaded magazine right here. I could shoot a green gas pistol for the first time. All right, here we go. That is so... Oh, ooh, the slide kind of messed up there. That is so freaking cool. It sounded so loud, too, though. I did not expect this to be that loud. That gun, man. That sounds like a real gun, dude. It sounds like a real freaking gun. Dude, I had no idea green gas guns were this freaking loud. All right, we're gonna do an accuracy test. We're gonna try to hit that Mountain Dew can right there. Okay, I'm, I really suck at aiming, by the way. There we go. All right, let's see what it looks like when it hits the water. All right, guys, so before I leave this video, I just wanted to make a quick comparison here of my first airsoft pistol. This is my first airsoft gun. It's a uh, Crossman Stinger. Um, it's based off a of 1911. This is a spring pistol. It's like maybe $20. I don't know how much that was. I got it like a long time ago. This is my latest gun right here, Gas Blowback. And sounds like, gosh, that is so loud, man. I had no idea that they were this freaking loud. But yeah, that's about it, guys.